This is a weeding robot that uses short bursts of man-made electrical lightning strikes. Created by the small robot company, the weeding robot works together with another robot whose job is to map every millimeter of the field and monitor the crops. The weeding robot then uses the data to autonomously move around the field, locating the weeds and targeting them with mini electrical lightning strikes, instead of using chemicals. This is the Dino weeding robot by Neo Technologies. The fleet of robots navigate by using two centimeter precise GPS and detects weeds using cameras and then scrapes them out with a specialized tool designed for each type of crop. AgroBot has created this autonomous bug vacuum robot. It uses a double fan vacuum system. This creates a uniformed upwards wind of 35 miles per hour or 56 kilometers per hour, designed to extract bugs but leave the crops untouched. This is the VTBot. Developed by Bacchus, it is an electric autonomous vineyard robot. The robot moves along each row of vines, working the soil and removing weeds, and it can work in all weather conditions. Nissan has developed an aquatic robot called Duck. The robot works to reduce pest plant growth in rice paddy fields. Farmers in Asia see ducks as natural allies, since their feet stir up the pond floor, preventing weeds from taking root and growing. Nissan developed their Duck robot to mimic this paddling action with a pair of rubber paddles. The robot is powered by solar energy and navigates by GPS. This is the E-Series robot. The Mega Robot by Agrobot has 24 robotic arms which each pick and harvest strawberries. A mixture of cameras and infrared depth sensors are used to feed the artificial intelligence. The AI can then detect the strawberry's position and ripeness. The robotic arms then cut the stems. LiDAR, which uses lasers, is used to create a 3D map of the robot's surroundings for safety and obstacles. The FarmBot is a CNC machine for plant beds. It will automatically grow plants for you. The FarmBot starts by planting seeds and knows which type of plant is planted in each location. It can then water each one based on its type and age. It can detect and pick out weeds as well as monitor things like soil moisture. No coding is required. The software helps you lay out the optimal plant bed, mixing different types. And the advanced version can automatically switch between tools for different jobs such as seeding, weeding, watering, and soil monitoring. NASA is even looking into how the farm bot could be used to farm food in space, on the moon, and on Mars. This is the milking robot called Astronaut by Lily Vector. It is designed to minimize stress for the cows and reduce the human workload. The cows approach the robot by themselves when they are ready to be milked. The machine recognizes each individual cow from the sensor on their collar, so the milking process can be adjusted according to personalized historical data. And brushes autonomously clean the udders.
Iron Ox has created entire year-round hydroponic farms that are run by robots. These indoor farms can produce about 30 acres worth of food on just a single acre of land. The farm is run by two robots. One moves trays of plants around, and the second has a robotic arm for manipulation tasks such as seeding and transplanting. The robots also use machine learning and AI to detect pests and diseases, removing plants before they infect others. Virgo is a high-speed automatic picking robot. It can pick any type of crops from tomatoes and strawberries to cucumbers, and Virgo is able to select and pick only the ripe ones. This picking robot by Root AI runs on a track and is able to work in dense greenhouse environments and can work day and night. NH Industrial have created an autonomous tractor. It works in a field spraying, planting, and harvesting. This driverless tractor can be hooked up to a farm's existing equipment for autonomous plowing or spraying. And it can keep working 24 hours a day, making the most of yearly seasons. Harvest Automation have created the HV100S robot. These robots are used to move and arrange plant pots in commercial growing facilities, such as a large nursery. And they can also gather the plants for seasonal protection. The $10,000 Burrow robot helps farm workers by transporting equipment and crops around the field. It allows farms to pick and pack up to 30% more. The robot can carry up to 500 pounds or 225 kilograms. It uses computer vision and high-precision GPS to follow workers around the field or move crops from the field to truck autonomously. 